Right, okay, so the new trailer for The Haunting of Verdansk has now been released for Warzone, and I must say, it's probably one of the better trailers that Call of Duty have done for one of their events. I will leave a link down below to the full trailer so you can check it out if you haven't already. But we can now see here with the new roadmap what is going to be coming along with this event. And of course, I did already make a video before on all of the new bundles coming, but now we can see a better look at some of these Halloween packs. So getting straight into things here with this new roadmap and going through all of the new updates and changes coming with this Haunted of Verdansk event. Firstly here we do have Haunted Verdansk obviously so the map being changed to dark and like I said from the trailer it looks really dope and I'm definitely going to be hopping in and checking this one out. I haven't played Warzone in a little while so definitely an incentive to hop back in with this one. Next to that we do have the 16 Trick or Treat rewards. Now this one is actually going to be a sort of scavenger hunt where it will send the players around the map to find like specifically marked supply drops and when you open these boxes it will either give you a treat or a fright so a trick or a treat so i believe if you get a fright or like a trick it's going to give you like a jump scare when you open the box or you could get the treat and that is how you actually get these 16 rewards these rewards being permanent items like blueprints and calling cards and if you do find all 16 of these rewards you will get this bonus blueprint here that you can see the pumpkin punisher for the growl just quickly here are some of the rewards you can get from these boxes so we've got a new melee weapon there some stickers calling cards blueprint and we also have a new watch now for new warzone game modes we do have zombie royale and if i just read this to you quickly it says when the clock strikes midnight in the dance it's time to bring out the undead operators can fight against and alongside powerful zombified creatures as part of zombie royale a limited time mode where death is far from permanent so instead of being sent to the gulag dead operators will come back to life as a zombie although zombies cannot use weapons they have supernatural abilities increased speed improved jumps deadlier melee attacks and thermal vision and when a player is killed they will drop a syringe that shows up on the map and if you do collect two of these syringes as a zombie, you'll parachute back in with your loadout for your squad as a second chance and you will come back as your operator. Along with that, the other game modes include Juggernaut Royale, Nighttime Battle Royale and then Nighttime Plunder as well. Then for multiplayer game modes, we do have Onslaughter. Now this one is where a Juggernaut suit will spawn somewhat on the map and you need to get control of it. And you can see when you are actually a Juggernaut, your head turns into sort of like a pumpkin or jack-o'-lantern, which is pretty dope. We also have the TDM Snipers Only, a gun fright playlist and then a halloween mosh pit playlist we have a new gunfight tournament starting along with double xp weekend and it says there the jack 12 but that one has already been released i don't know if they just gave that one to us early but now they've shown it on the roadmap now here we go the new bundles coming to the game with this update probably the main thing i do on my channel recently and a lot of people are waiting to see these when i do the showcase videos so make sure you do subscribe to the channel with notifications on i will be taking a look at all of these new bundles tomorrow and i will be doing giveaways as well so make sure you are subscribed like I said, follow me on Twitter and join my Discord server down below. And do let me know in the comment section which bundles you want me to do a giveaway for. Bundles we do have confirmed coming tomorrow are the Saw Bundle and the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. But of course, there are other ones as well which will be released later on. And like I did mention before, I have already done a preview video where I go through all of the upcoming bundles in the game. But if we do have another look at what is coming tomorrow and first up with the Saw Bundle, I'll put some images on screen so you can see the actual skin a bit more. And this one is the Billy skin, obviously from the Saw films and if you didn't know the actual operator behind this skin is Morte and the items we do have included in this one are the CR56 AMAX as the legendary blueprint, the death trap model 680 shotgun, we also have a new combat knife, a new vehicle skin, a charm, the sticker, calling card, emblem and spray as well. I'll put an image on screen you can see the actual bundle. And then moving over to the new Texas Chainsaw Massacre bundle, we have the Skin Crawler, which is actually a Velican Operator skin. We have the new Family Heirloom as the chainsaw looking sort of weapon. We have the Buzz Killer MP5, the Meat Grinder as the new melee weapon. We have the new Vehicle Horn, the chainsaw as the keychain there, the new sticker, calling card, emblem and the spray. Of course, like I mentioned, there is a lot of other Halloween bundles coming to the game as well, such as the Dr. Karloff bundle, and of course, everyone knows about the Ghost Grim Reaper on this channel. I think everyone's excited for that one, so I will be covering those as well when they are released, especially that Ghost one. You can see here, I'll put some images on screen. You can see them in the trailer as well. It looks so dope, and that's definitely going to be one I'm going to check out, and I know people are going to want me to do a giveaway for that one, so make sure you do drop a like on this video and you are subscribed to the channel. And yeah, that's pretty much going to be it for this video today, taking a look at everything that's coming tomorrow 
with this new Haunting of the Dansk event in Modern Warfare. So let me know what you think about all of this stuff in the comment section below. Like I said, drop a like if you enjoyed the video. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel with notifications on. Follow me on Twitter and join my Discord server if you want to interact with me more. And yeah, I'll see you next time.